Hi there, this is Rob from The Property Man. I'm here today at this absolutely stunning four bedroom townhouse, uh, which is located on the Heaton Moor uh, stroke Burnage border. Uh, so we're on Maldiff Road, uh, and obviously over there is Heaton Moor, and then just here is uh, Burnage, so you're right on the border, and you've got the circle there with all the shops. Um, it's not the particularly best of days to show this because of the weather, but um, you've got a driveway here which uh, should accommodate two cars, but there is plenty of parking uh, just at the side uh, over here. Uh, so I'll take you in to see the property because I don't like getting my hair wet. So as we walk into uh, into the entrance hallway, it's very, very tastefully decorated this. Now this property is going to be unfurnished. Uh, so any furniture that you do see will uh, will not be included in the property as long as pictures, etc. Um, so as you walk in, you have all this um, laminate stroke LVT style flooring, um, which is great if uh, it's a wet day like today, you can just kick your shoes off, etc. And then you've got all this very tasteful wallpaper that leads all the way up the staircase. Let's go left into the open plan living stroke kitchen area. So we'll run through everything that we've got here. Um, so you've got all these lovely plantation shutters uh, throughout uh, the property. Uh, you've got this very, very modern um, uh, light grey kitchen here, uh, which has uh, things like integrated dishwasher. Uh, you've got a double oven. You have an electric uh, induction hob and extractor fan over it. Uh, you have a full size fridge and freezer and then you've got two or more storage units there uh, and if i just show it you from this angle you can see everything else is storage so there's absolutely bags of space in here tons of space um really good size this is 10 meters long uh this room and it flows into your dining area and then into a good size uh, living area as well so before we go through there i have under here a um, space for the washing machine so that all goes under there uh, which is perfect and then you've got your dining area here which is great because it's located just next to the kitchen area uh, and then we go into the living room so you've got uh, plenty of natural light in here it's a south facing garden so you get all the sun in the day and i wish the sun would come out today because it's chucking it down and it would show how sunny this garden is but uh, look at the size of this sofa that they've got so as you can see really good size this room and you can see how much space that you have in this living area. And then you have all your TV points on here uh, to uh, to put your tally on the wall, etc. So really good entertaining space here. And I think it's great, you know, if you've got people around, uh, you've got your kitchen, you've got your, your dining area and your living area, so you're not isolated from other rooms. Just before I take you outside to see the garden, just on the side here, you have a really handy downstairs toilet so you've got your wall mounted sink and uh, WC there so it's great if you're a family and you need the downstairs toilet so let me take you outside as I say this is a south facing garden and you've got this really large patio door here that swings open I'm not going to step outside because it gets all the camera wet but as you can see um, you're all enclosed you've got this wall to, to the right hand side fence at the back with an access gate that, so you can take your bins out etc uh, there's a timber shed here and then you have your um, Indian stone patio and artificial grass at the back so this is a very very low maintenance garden here let's close this door okay so let's go upstairs I'm going to show you uh, the bedrooms upstairs so um, first floor, you have two double bedrooms and a centrally located bathroom. And then on the top floor, you have the main bedroom with ensuite and then a further fourth bedroom, but actually it's kitted out as a dressing room. But let's do each room at a time. So as I go up the stairs, have a look at the floor plan so you can see the layout of this property. Uh, you've got uh, two double bedrooms on this floor. So your first double bedroom is in here. Again, really good size. And then just here, you've got these full-size mirrored fitted wardrobes, which is great for a second bedroom. And they say they've got really good size bed in here and there's bags of room either side of it. Walk through the hallway on the landing, sorry. And then you have uh, your bathroom located here. I'm trying not to get myself in the mirror. Um, so let's get down on my knees. So you've got uh, your toilet, a fully tiled bathroom, full-size bath with a rain head shower over it. Uh, and then you've got your wall mounted uh, sink unit there. But as you can see, really nice shower in there and obviously a really nice deep bath. 
And then let's go through to uh, the second double bedroom in here. Again, really big bed in here, plenty of room to walk around. Let me show you from this angle. So this property is double glazing, it's all gas central heating. So just in this cupboard here is your uh, combi boiler. Obviously everything will be tested and checked prior to moving in. Uh, so nice, be nice and warm, uh, this property. So let's go up to the top floor where the main bedroom is. It's located at the rear. Again, a really good size bedroom in here and you've got all these uh, lovely sort of vaulted ceiling here uh, to give you lots of, uh, there's lots of height in this room. And again, they've got a really big bed in here. And as you can see, there's, there is plenty of room. I'll just swing the camera around this way so you can have a look. And then through here, we've got walk-in, uh, say a walk-in wardrobe, we've got all these fitted wardrobe units here. So you can literally walk through wardrobe space on the right hand side. And then we have the bathroom in here. Again, let's get on my knees so you don't see me in the mirror. So you've got your ensuite bathroom in here, heated towel radiator, lovely towel flooring. WC, you've got your shower enclosure with your rain head shower, and then you've got your uh, hand basin there. Again, all fully tiled, so nice and easy to maintain. Really good size bedroom. So finally, we've got bedroom four, which is located at the front. So this is kitted out as a dressing room. So you've got absolutely bags of wardrobe space in here. And then on the other side, you've got lots and lots of shelving units. Um, and tall, tall cabinets there, where obviously you can put all your clothes, shoes, handbags, whatever we need. Um, but this could be a great nursery if needed. So there is room here. You could put a cot in here if you want and have it as a, as a really nice nursery or a home office if you need it. So uh, perfect, perfect size room. And I think they kitted it out uh, very well for, for what they need. So this property is available to rent. Now you don't get many of these properties coming to the market uh, for rent. Uh, so this property is available for rent. If you would like to arrange a viewing, then you can contact our team on 0161 519 8855. That's 0161 519 8855. Alternatively, you can email us at lettings at thepropertyman.co.uk. That's lettings at thepropertyman. .co.uk. And that's Rob Smith from The Property Man here at this four bed townhouse located on Moldeth Road on the Heaton, uh, Heaton border and Burnage border. Thank you.